bola vai, foi no mar agora. Epa! The NFL is trying to kill it every time. They've been doing a good job for the last 30 years. It was, it was supposed to take off, then they killed the NASL. It's coming back. The Gillette Stadium had a, a statue of Eusebio, uh, just like the one here at the right, right, right. Stadio de Luz. And um, Bob Kraft had it taken out. It's yep. at the Portuguese club in Ludlow, where my son, where my son plays. Yep. Yeah, the NFL is actively trying to kill soccer all over the world. It's the only sport that can compete. They can't get into any market because of the because of soccer, and they're trying to take. Wanted, wanted them to scrap it. And yep. We were lucky because the construction company that was working there took it. Knew a construction company from Ludlow, it's Portuguese. Says, hey, you guys, uh, are you interested in this thing? They told me to get rid of it. <laughs> and now it lives at the Portuguese club in Ludlow. That's that's cool. That's a good story, man. That's why I don't watch football, American football. Actively, they can't compete. They can't compete with this game. That's the only way they can compete is by trying to undercut it. Yeah, they know it. American football is a good game, but um, it's nothing compared to this. It's, exactly. and it's never going to be as big as soccer. As, uh, soccer is worldwide. It's just a matter of time before soccer takes over America. It's getting close. Getting there, yeah. Really it's, they got to set up the academies. Once they set up the academies, they'll start sucking the players out. That's what the NFL is trying to kill right now. They're trying to kill there, there academies. Are, there are academies. They know. Just, the team plays against a lot of academies. Just starting. They've been killing it for the last 20 years. They've been trying to set up academies for 20 years. They won't let it start up. They keep killing it. And then the other thing is, uh, is when they play to have relegation. They keep killing relegation play because if this, once they open up relegation play, once the pros have relegation play, it'll be so competitive it won't even be funny. And, and then the game will take off. But until they until they get relegation and have multiple leagues, but they just started it. NASL and the uh, the A League have now started promotion and rele relegation between their two leagues. So that's started. There's, there's a lot of you know big things that are happening. You're looking in the next 10, 10 years, you're looking at it just taking off. This, the monopoly play system that the NFL has and American sports has with no promotion and relegation, where owners got to approve other owners to come in and to start new teams. That's just a monopoly system. And that's why they're trying to kill soccer. They 
like their little monopoly. They get their little area. They make their little money all the time. It's a professional sport. It's all about money. My son has never played that position ever before in his life. He's usually the right winger, but I think it's because of his age. Well, my, my son never was never a right winger until he came here. I always played him on defense when he came to his camp. Defense, well, you're a right winger. He's all right. Spill. At least he got back. fio vai mais acima Oh, saw the sun the sun angle is better here I got a pretty good zoom Uh, after five years, you get. I cashed it out. You did. Gotcha. Had an option to take it, take it in cash, or uh, when it turned sixty or whatever. Right, 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 right. So I, I took the took the cash check up front, put it into an investment instead. Why'd you leave the job? Uh, 
Um, got tired of oil, greasy fingers? No, in, in short, it was because I could. You know, really no other reason, I loved my job. <laughs> and, uh, and I had the opportunity to not have to punch a card, so, so let me try it. Yeah, I did it the other way around. My dad had an electrical company. We did that for years. And I was all like, yeah, I'm not a businessman. So I went and joined the union. 